lubricate and bleed can be used as alternative killing method, in case the influx cannot be removed. Either by circulation, or by bullheading. In this example, the gas is already at the top of the well. Just below a closed Christmas tree valve. Since the kill fluid and the gas will be evacuated. Through the same flow path. Then the process will be done step by step. First, a specific amount of kill fluid to be pumped into the well. And then, the well is to be closed again. To wait the fluid to go down, below the gas column. After waiting. It is expected that the kill fluid. Is going down below the gas column. And then. The well pressure could be reduced a little bit. By bleeding off some gas. This procedure is then repeated. Pump. And wait. And bleed off gas. And repeat. Until zero well head pressure. If kill fluid is 13.5 ppg. And three barrels is pumped in every step. And tubing capacity is 0.0188 barrels per foot. Then the pressure to be bled off is 112 psi. Using previous calculations. And 12 psi safety margin. After pumping three barrels of kill fluid. And waiting. Then the well pressure could be bled off by 100 psi. So in this example. Well pressure will go down in steps. From 600, to 500. And then to 400. And so on, until reach zero at the end. However. When the kill fluid is pumped into the well. Well pressure will increase a little bit. Due to gas compression. Since the gas cannot go out during this pumping time. But our final pressure after bled off. Should be 100 psi. Less than the pressure before pumping. 